Hi there! Last time I posted a video about optical illusions and how different placement of the lines can change our body shapes differently. As I have received very good feedback from you and you showed great interest in this topic, I decided to make a video about the prints and different colors. I'll be using same examples as I did last time, so I'll be wearing totally the same dress, but I will make some transformations with the help of this white tape. First of all, let's start with colors. Probably I don't have repeat the statement that dark color conceals, but today we're talking about the proofs. So let's have a look into rectangulars. As you see here, black rectangular appears to look smaller than a white one. If we would add a circle inside these rectangulars, the effect would be even more noticeable. Circle appears to look bigger in white color. Lighter color always stands out from the whole picture and therefore the object in white color looks a little bit bigger. Now let's have a look into the example with the dresses. It is obvious that white color comes forward and at the same time making my body parts in white look larger accordingly. However, it doesn't mean that only black and white create such an illusion because any darker color placed next to the brighter or lighter color creates that slimming effect. So for example, if you are wearing pink from head to toe, just place a little bit darker tones on the body parts that you are self-conscious about. Another great tool to slim down your figure is by using color blocking, where two or even more colors are used in graphic shapes to create different illusions. Let's have a look into rectangulars. Here you see the same size rectangulars and the one on the right looks thinner and longer since dark color panels elongate sides and slims, slims down the rectangular <laughs> if he wants to be slimmer. <laughs> right now, let's jump into the example of the dresses. So vertical panel lines here on the left makes me appear taller, leaner, and slimmer. If you want to create curves on your body shape, then choose curved ball lines as here in this example. White part comes forward and tricks the eye, therefore creating additional curves on my body. With all the examples, I want to show you only the principle. So for example, if you don't have color blocking dress, you just can add a blazer on top of your blouse and you will create like darker sides, therefore you will slim down your figure. So be creative and use this information to work for you. Now let's talk about the prints and how busy prints can trick our eyes. As usually, let's start with the rectangulars. We see that the one on the right with the print immediately catches our attention. Therefore, we could presume that it is bigger. Let's see the example with the dresses. We see that prints draw the eye and tend to enlarge the area. Therefore, I look a little bit bigger on the left. Once again, be creative and interpret this rule as you need it. For instance, you can hide a little bit larger upper part of your body by wearing something very eye-catching on your bottom part. Now let's check the size of the prints and how different size of the prints create different illusions. As you notice, the rectangular on the right looks bigger with bigger prints than the one on the left with smaller scaled prints. The same appears in the example of the dresses, because the rule is the smaller the print, the smaller you will look. Small scaled prints trick the eye, while big scaled prints draw the attention. In addition, the placement of the prints really matters. Fuzzy, frequent prints flick before the eye and camouflage. These prints make it difficult to see what's happening behind them. Therefore, it looks smaller and thinner on the right with small and frequently placed prints. Another way to look slimmer with prints is to choose strategically placed prints. For instance, if you want to elongate and slim down your body, choose the prints which creates vertical lines, like so. To sum everything up, if you want to enlarge some parts of your body, then choose items either with decorations or bright light colors. And if you want to create an opposite effect, choose solid, darker colors to visually reduce a part of your body. The key is to understand all these principles and to make them work for us. 
So thank you for watching and see you next time.